Well, that's me, and I'm here in Florida ready to have a good time looking for video games and hanging out with my friends. Hello, world. Great. Now, I may get sidetracked once in a while due to where we are in Florida on the beach, but I promise you I bought some things that I never thought I would buy. Oh, God, this is going to get wild. What are we looking at, Caleb? It has even better details on the inside, just like me. It's beautiful. So I'm here at in Florida at Really Rad Weekend with Caleb. A whole bunch of people just bought from him right there, my amazing friend at Retro Bash. Ricky's over there, everyone's jiving. Show them what I got, show them that. Ooh. Oh gosh, that is beautiful. Show them the back. <sighs> Captain N, beautiful. Crazy. Nintendo. I, I'm actually probably gonna rock that, and then a turbo graphics, double-sided windbreaker. Show them the back of that turbo graphics too, it's pretty beautiful. What a beautiful way to start my day. What a better video than to start with beautiful stuff and the most handsome looking version of Caleb I've ever seen. Scruffy, just a little bit of rawness to him, maybe even a slightly bit, a couple gray hairs. I think you're oh, more looking- More than a couple. You're looking great, dude. You know why? Why? All of your edits that you send me. <laughs> and Marger is in there hanging out right now. Good to see him. Oh, look at these guys. What's up, man? What's up, guys? Look at these. Good looking men right We're here. here. Thank you. Really rad weekend. If you're not here, what are you doing? He's right, you know. What happened? He asked you to sign. That's probably the best looking hat you'll ever see. So does this have, it, it's got a lot of ink in it. I could no! really, yes, I'll sign. Who I'm else is on there? Ricky, Riff, was it Curtis and Ben? Yeah, Curtis and Ben. Time to ruin it. All right. <laughs> Reseller scum, just sign it that. <laughs> Oh, my name. speaking of, <laughs> speaking of, you called <laughs> Caleb. Good sir, is this is this mission switch or just mission life? This is mission money. Oh, dude, why is that not a thing on your show? I know. I, I always say money. Yeah, I should talk a little bit more about money. Dumb. Oh. Okay, real talk. I have beat one of these games. This one. Where is it? The Messenger. I beat this game. Oh, really? Yeah, it's a beautiful game. I, I did beat this one. Really? Not a hundred percent. I I rarely hundred percent games. Really. You yeah. just got past like the intro screen? Exactly. Nice. That, and I'm um, just check it off the list. Good, done. All right, Ricky, go ahead and get your right, computer. Get we have our panel in a second. We're trying to give you guys a little bit more like realistic style YouTube videos lately that aren't just like bye, 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 but more like real life. All right, I just came in, got our stuff for our panel. So I got our tablets and all that. My wife is here, my beautiful wife and her beautiful sister. Hanging out, say hello to the world. Hi world. <laughs> and it's panel time. Oh, we need to get your your husband recently started a YouTube channel. I need, I need to get him. I need to get him out there and show some love. He's learning to edit. From like, you. I have been training him to edit. It's been really fun teaching him a little bit. So all right, now we're our panel. Ugh. Just in case we didn't want to get it wet. What is it? And now a quick video from today's sponsor, Anchor. You all know I'm kind of the editing guy. I'm always out with a laptop or with a phone or a camera or something that needs some sort of charging or anything like that. And I want to thank today's sponsor, Anchor. I wanted to make you guys aware that Anchor.com is having a Christmas sale. It's up to 40% off. I really encourage you guys to go check the link down in the description below. Now is the time to do it. You know that there's going to be anyone in your life or including yourself that will need stuff like this. Go check out the landing page down below in my description. Thank you so much to Anchor for sponsoring this video. And now a quick little video from them. Ooh, a backpack, nice. I think we're okay now. Um, yeah, check it out, guys. Again, this year, different than last year because it does look like the rain is supposed to kind of clear up, so that's the goal. And the panel rooms are just over there, over yonder. And that is, wow, ow. And that is a loud noise. That's where the panel room is. And this cool building, the tavern right next to the waterfall. Ricky's first time here. You make me sick. That's, Wait, that's actually, so it's a mariachi, mariachi music. Ricky should give out this one. Ricky! <laughs> Mariachi music 8 bit. Come on, Ricky. Who is it? Who is it? Number 24. Oh. Number. Oh! Ay <laughs> 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 
So you said you're awkward. What brought you to this convention? Um, the retro video games, the Nintendo Power. You're a Nintendo Power person? Yeah, I am. Are you a collector or are you just here to support? I'm here to support. <laughs> wow! That's a keeper. Long day, day one in the books. I think I'll uh, hit back to you guys tomorrow, day two. Again, trying to give you guys a little more of a real look at some of the behind the scenes stuff, the way we just kind of, you know, hang out with people. Is that weird? I don't know, whatever, real life. All right, it's the next morning and now we've had our fun. We've done our goofiness. We've bought stuff too as well, but today we're actually gonna go buy a couple things that we've been looking at at the convention. Ricky, you're a true island boy. I'm an island boy. Do I look like an island boy? Mm, your skin color. Oh. Ricky, dive in, bro. Go, go, go. Ah! And for those who haven't seen yet the tour La Resistance, you kind of go in through this beautiful door and then this is where it kind of opens up right here. Beautiful, nice. Look at the views, yep, they say hello too. Beautiful views, little place to eat some island food. And then, uh, yeah, back in here is where the convention takes place. Look at this idiot, Ricky. What's he doing? Probably just, really, he's probably offering that guy like $2 yeah. and explaining to him why that nobody so, buys yeah. those consoles anymore. I'm down here. What's happening here? Turbo Graphics, in the box, what's happening here, Ricky? With the powerful Turbo Graphics 16-bit system that puts you in control of intense gaming excitement for just $99.99. Each system comes with ready-to-play games like Keith Courage and this $50 value, a free box. Look at all that paper. Ooh, paper. Where's Ooh, Curtis? Uh-oh, we got the Turbo Master over here. <laughs> yeah. I mean, dude, those coupons right there are legit. Actually, yeah. Ooh, look at this one. The registration card. Well, the guy from Keith Courage. Keith Courage, yep. Oh, that's, here, you can take a peek at that. You're the king of turbo. Yeah, the turbo. Ooh, look at this one, too. Wow, this is a good CIB box. For real. Maybe I should have bought this. I mean, just this alone, look at that. Yeah, that's actually, that is so beautiful. I know. Oh, yeah. I don't see this in there very often at all. His sword is drawn. Like, <laughs> like the tip, the, the base of the sword is like half a millimeter. Thank you for buying this Turbo Graphics. Oh, you're welcome. Wow. Basically, what we're doing, debating if we bought it. It's kind of a, as we talked about in a recent podcast, buy it all yeah. or buy nothing because you get the better deal if you buy it all. Well, I un I think the vendors have just gotten smarter. Like they know that if you're coming through and we all do this, like you want to cherry pick out the good games, right? Like you yeah. want to go through a lot. You see a stack of PS2 games. Like you don't want the Maddens. You don't want the garbage games that are in there. You want to pick out the good titles. But I do think that the vendors realize if you come and pick out those good titles, they're never going to sell the Maddens and they just sit there. So it also has like an EverDrive over there, booster. the booster. Turbo booster. They use the boost to get through right there. But brace yourself for a shock. All this CD power is only, but not forever, so power up fast. And then there's Blazing Lasers, Air Zonk, Alien Crush, Dragon Spirit, Bomberman, Bonks, R-Type. And how much did you say for everything? Total for everything is 11 Okay. Buy it all. Buy it all discount about seven fifty. About seven fifty. Mm. Console in box. You have the RF for by any chance? I don't. What do you think? What about? Well, that's for you. What does he get? Okay, okay, okay. All right. Here's what we're thinking right now. We're thinking everything for seven fifty. But he also said he'll throw in a game for each of us, obviously within reason. I was thinking like a low low two. Obviously, Ricky, we're not going to want to be that guy to grab those. I know he would do that. What about you? Uh, low low three. Oh, oh dang it! Yeah. <laughs> uh, all right. Sure. Are you Are you sure? Wait, do I have Lolo one? Do you have Lolo one? Okay. So the Turbo Graphics set and the Lolo set. Thank you. Appreciate it. What have we done? What have you done? You over here ogling me? Dude, that was a great deal. The The deal itself was a really good deal. That, I, I can't deny the deal. But I think the quality of the titles speaks a lot because we got games like Air Zonk, Blazing Lasers, Alien Crush, Bonk's Adventure, Keith Courage, of course, which I love the game. I know a lot of people aren't the biggest fans, but 
playing Air Zonk, again, the, Ricky and I have a big story with Air Zonk a long time ago, going to a convention, Ricky had to give it to somebody. Yeah. But we're, we, we, have, we have a deeper love for Turbo itself on the show. I feel like we were always kind of into it when a lot of yeah. people were super into it. Threw in those Lolo games. I know, I was like, sucker. It's good, we love you. So I bought this from Adam Retrobeard, but I have Sam here to hold it because, uh, and I bought one of these, also so did your husband. Correct, this is his yeah, actual is. one. That's what his signs like technically look like over here. I'm sure you're kind of like, you're getting known around the, the scene now, you know. But now we're gonna steal Sam to use for thumbnails. Everyone knows that that's what you do, right? <laughs> how, how much are you paying Sam for the thumbnail? All right, the reality is, I don't need any more games at all. Neither does Ricky. We don't need anything else. We don't need to fly anything else home, but we're going to. We're gonna buy some stuff from Rad Junk, uh, from Joe, who puts on the show, simply yeah. to support. Like, I don't technically need any of this stuff, but I cool feel like awesome. the best way to support is to support their local business, what they do. Uh, Rad Junk is their store yeah. that is affiliated with Really Rad Weekend. So we're gonna do that now. What are you buying right now, so far? So far? Pokemon Stadium. Let's go. Yay. Come on, I love bro. this game. Look how good, dude. It's got everything in Come there. The pack. Okay. Nice. The pack, dude. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna exchange. Like I have one, but it's not complete, and it's not this nice of a condition. So I'll probably end up selling that one and keeping it. So what I've created here for myself is the really rad weekend bundle because Bam's here. So I got myself the skateboarding games and then Star Tropics because it's kind of like on the island on the. Um, also, I do love Skater I 1 and 2. I don't know which one I would say is better. Talked about this one a million times, but part two is like kind of a different game. It's almost like a side-scrolling platformer in a way. It's not exactly a little more free-roaming, going through malls, really fun. And then this, the music's just stupid. So. Okay, so I gotta rescue my uncle, but I'm not too sure how to find him. So I go to this island, right? But first, I gotta talk to the chief. And then I gotta get some clues from a parrot. And then I'm helping these dolphins, and all the time I'm sneaking through graveyards and shooting zombies and blasting monsters. Now for like the most frustrating, less, less exciting part uh, for us when you're traveling at expos, and that is packing everything. That is getting everything packaged. So we bought multiple suitcases for us to be able to load up. There's my shirts, yes, that is how I fold. I roll all my stuff. Those are suitcases we brought to ship just to pack with our stuff. But we have to remember, we also brought our wives. Uh, flew down my wife's sister as well to come hang out as well. So they have stuff they're gonna want to pack. So, oh, this is filling up quick. <laughs> we need two it's suitcases. Like We're like, gonna need two gonna... suitcases. No, oh, that's gonna have to lay down for sure. This is okay. We'll do this later. We'll let you guys know what fits. So almost all of it. Well, almost everything fit in these two suitcases for Ricky and I. That doesn't account for our wives. They're gonna have to buy more suitcases. We just told them to go to some Goodwills, buy some more suitcases. We'll probably need a total of like four or five to ship back home. And, you know, we're still gonna go to the convention. We're still gonna buy a bunch of stuff and go over there, but it's, it's time to end the video because I wanna go enjoy this a little bit more than going back in the convention right now. That's the whole point of this expo. Really rad weekend, again, really rad weekend. Yes, it's a really rad convention, but that's not the point. The point is to enjoy this. So, time to do it, Ricky, and then we fly home in a couple days. Beautiful, see you guys. Uh, oh.